know, God's an amazing, amazing God. I've always been brought up, I've always, all these 19 years of evangelizing and going across this country, I know one thing, when God speaks, you better listen. All right. All right. You know, sometimes you can get your mind made up of what you want to preach, and God says, not so fast, my friend. I'll tell you one thing, I just got excited a while ago, oh, I just want to go, but this God kind of shifted me in another year. And I don't know what God's about to do here, but you've got to understand. I don't know why God's really trying to impress this upon us, but He's trying to impress you people that He is really here. Alright? That it ain't just a theme of our imagination. We're not just here boogalooing and shouting and just uh,
like a mule at a new gate. <laughs> then all of a sudden the roof tore open and they dropped a man into his presence and everybody said, hey, what's, what's, what's going on? Somebody got to get to Jesus. Right. I'm just saying, whatever it takes for you to get a miracle, let's get it. Right. Well, I'm not part of this church. I'm not asking you to be a part of this church. I'm just asking you to get everything you can get from God. Right. Chapter 18, verse 20. Ah, Lord, this is such a familiar scripture, but it's just, a, it's just the simplicity of the Word of God. Oh. Pastor Manzano, I thought for a second he was just going to steal it right away from me. Talk about them thousands. We're two or three. Oh. I got to think about it. God, you're just awesome, man. <laughs> Where two or three are gathered together again, my name. Oh. And when I say his name. His name. What's his name? Jesus. What's his name? Jesus. Who is in the house? Jesus. Who can deliver? Jesus. Who can fill people with the Holy Ghost? Jesus. Clap your hands if you believe that. He said, I am there in the midst of people. I don't know why here recently God is really stressing to me. You've got to make sure they understand that we're not just going through the motions. Right. right. But I am truly there. Right. right. You can't see it, but you can feel it if you want to feel it. That's right. right. All I know is this. Twelve people lined up here yesterday that God filled them with the Holy Ghost. That's not emotion. That's power. That's the Holy Ghost and God coming into their lives and making a difference in their lives. He really believes that Jesus is here. Yeah. One more time, turn around and say, Jesus is in the house for somebody. Oh, come on, come on, come on, shake somebody's hand. Say, I know you've got it going on, but Jesus is in the house. Give the Lord a good hand clap as you receive it. Come on, give the Lord a good shout of praise.